Okay. I'm not even going to pretend at this point. Are we, you rolling? Yes, I am rolling, Scott. <laughs> and you've started and stopped this three times now. Sorry, here we go. Something in your eye, Andy? Don't eat cereal with your hands. These guys hate when you hand jam. Spoon in. The tangent. Oh, did you want me to stop it? Yeah. Oh. Sorry, I heard, Brody. I heard it prior because, again, we started and stopped this already. Well, I made a mistake and I hit stop on the, the, this thing instead of that thing. And then before that, you – I don't know what happened. Why do you like to make fun of me? It's not making fun of you. It's just pointing out. Like, like for me, if I don't do something, it's millennials not doing it right. Andrew, I had a long, rough weekend, so just let me have this, Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. Welcome to Serial Killers. Today is Monday, July 12th, episode 187. Yeah. I think maybe we shouldn't say the date anymore, just in case we want to take a week off and we just push one ahead or something like that, you know? So I'll just give the episode numbers. Not that you even care, but it's just kind of impressive that we've had 187 episodes of this. Yeah. Let's give ourselves a quick pat in the back. No. Um... All right, so oh, why don't okay. we get to what? So now why why do you get to make fun of me? I'm not I don't like to pat myself on the back. I, you legit just said it's pretty awesome that we got up to 187 episodes. Yeah, but I didn't require a pat on the back from oh myself. Oh my god, here we go. It's Would, impressive, but it's not impressive if Andy says it's impressive. I have to be contrary Carl. Contrary? Yeah. Mary Mary quite? Well, I wanted it to be an alliteration. Oh. It's not the two same letters. I don't know. Hey, listen, can we please eat cereal? Because I'm really excited for this one. It is new from Jen. Please leave that alone. Please, that's for my daughter for camp. Please don't take it all apart. That's a lot of lollipops. I, I found lollipops for her in that candy box that's been here for months, and she wants to take it to camp. So just oh, put it down. Oh, great. All right, thanks. Anyway, so uh, thank you, General Mills. Actually, no, I'm not thanking General Mills. This cereal is from General Mills, but I bought it. Okay. Yes. It is the newest in the line of cereals featuring the mascot, Sir Charms. Oh, Lucky Charms with Marshmallows. No, that's not what it's called. Learn Luck- about cereal. Learn anyway, about cereal. <laughs> currently in the... <laughs> that's not what it's called. Currently in the... That's uh, not what it's called. On the roster of Lucky Charms, you have the regular, you have the silly galactic ones that just came out for a little while. There's chocolate. There's still fruity out there somewhere. Honey is still kind of in some stores. I don't know. That wasn't all that spectacular. And now, brand new, Andrea. Are you ready? Andrea? I called you Andrea. <laughs> That's not what it's called. Is there something I don't know, buddy? No. no? Okay. Um, I'm going to go down to the cereal sack, and I'm going to grab it. And I did buy an extra box, because they were only 99 cents, to give away to one of our special listeners. Woo! Now, this cereal, if you know, the um, image of this box was floating around for quite some time. It was a year ago, I believe, that I posted a picture of this and said, hmm, coming soon? And General Mills was like, No. I even because I emailed them and they're like, we don't know what you're talking about. This was supposed to be the replacement. <laughs> what for Rice Krispie Treat cereal? Because remember, Rice Krispie Treats went away, and then this all of a sudden came on the scene. Well, they came back with it, okay, but it was no. a new recipe. Right, but once the second, once the new recipe went yeah. away, General Mills is like, huh? Let's fill the void, and everyone was like, ah, oh, this is gonna be it. I'm reading rumblings online that this ain't it. Let's try it, Andrew. Scott's got his pulse to all the latest cereal news. <laughs> Lucky Charms Marshmallow Clusters. I'm so excited. Are you? Yes. <sighs> I, I want to get this, this going. Where, where's the cereal thing? Shake, shake, shake. shake. Scotty, shake. Uh, shake your cereal. You know, the, the problem is, is it's still in two separate categories. I wish that you would uh, organize things for me. Well, I apparently know nothing about life or computers, as you like to say, but yet I'm the one who also uploads everything. Side note on that one. I'll do the uh-huh. Debbie Gibson one. Shake your box. You've got to shake your box. Shake your box. Scotty must shake his box. you got to watch out. One day you might break a hip. <laughs> First of all, I only have one hip, right? What? Do I have one hip or you have hips? You have hips. Well, they don't lie. <laughs> Father's right. Day is over, Scott. You can't get away with that. That's one. right. Also, right. what does your shirt say? Snickers. How long have you had this shirt? Oh no, it's like that vintage look. It so didn't wash off. It came like that. That's not vintage looking. That's like you found it in a puddle and picked it up and washed it. I don't really understand. It's th- th- not even there. That's how it came. 
But what I'm saying... It's supposed to look vintage. That's not vintage looking. That's like... Dude, I didn't make it. I just wear it. All right, here we go. Um, Those are big, big pieces. These aren't marshmallow clusters. They're just different shaped Lucky Charms yeah, pieces. It just looks like big Lucky Charms. All right, hold on. I look, I'm not going to knock it until we try it. And give our review. My hair is so effed up today. Look at this. I got different parts back here doing things. I have different parts over here doing things. I got a haircut. That's exciting for you. Thanks for the uh, frightening 7-Eleven 2% reduced fat milk. You go to 7-Eleven all the time for milk. Not that one. Not that one. That one's scary. That one's scary. I'm a white man who's 46 years old and I'm scared to walk down the street of New York. <sighs> Didn't... Okay. Here you go, Andrew. Ready? It's got I'm all terrified. The, it's got all the marshmallows, your pink hearts, and... I gotta tell you, right. the smell is not it. If this is supposed to be a replacement, how? Okay. <laughs> but they're not marshmallow clusters. You're thinking that you're going to wind up being eating like a Rice Krispie treat. It's not. Um. They almost taste and feel like cat and corn cereal pieces. Eat the, eat the cereal pieces on its own. It, it's cat and crunch is what that is. Eat that. Yeah. Same consistency. Same rips the mouth up. Um. Also, like, what is that supposed to be? I know they're saying clusters, but what kind of cluster? Because that looks like straight up deer poop. No, I think <laughs> it looks like a giant clover or something. Anyway. It's good. It's just not what it, it's advertised to be. Right. I give this four bowls. Hey, listen, I got to do something real quick. Stand by. <laughs> hold on. Sorry, I forgot to do something. That's going to screw up somebody else in the building. So hold on. <laughs> What's happening? Hold on. That's okay. Okay. Now we're fine. Scott doing production on the fly. No, I wasn't doing production, but what I did is I didn't really end the morning show before the Ryan Seacrest show took over, so they weren't able to control anything from the other studio for 16 minutes. That's great. But that's so, okay. Are you now going to rely on this solely for income? Uh -huh. <laughs> great. Look, um, yeah, four bowls. It's good. It's not um, Rice Krispie Treat cereal good. I don't even think it, it comes into even the pantheon of a Rice Krispie Treat cereal. Look, I'm a massive fan of Lucky Charms. You know it's a five bowler all time for me. Yeah. Um, I just, I, I can't really get into this that much. It's I like marshmallows. I like Lucky Charms. This is not Lucky Charms to me. I'm going to give it, I'm teetering between three bowls and a spoon and four. Uh, it's four bowls is fair. You want to go opinion. four? Right, I'll go four. I'll go four. So we have the same rating. Yeah. It's good. Don't get me wrong. I want to make this very clear. It is a good cereal, but it's not Rice Krispie Treat cereal. No, not and at all. The clusters, meh. They're not marshmallow clusters. They're cereal pieces. Yeah. So, okay. Me move on. Yay. Oh, by the way, I think it's pretty funny. Because you remember in the last episode, if you listen to the last episode, in the middle somewhere, uh -huh. when you're bitching and moaning about the uh, peanut butter and jelly cereal from Wegmans, uh -huh. remember that? Remember? You had Scott pull up the No, no, no. I went. I looked at the ratings. Uh -huh. You gave it five bowls. You said it was so disgusting, but you gave it five bowls. The first one that we did ever was delicious. Yeah, but then you said, oh, the other one was gross, too. No. The first one that we ever yeah. did was delicious. Millville was delicious. Millville was delicious. Yeah, and you said we didn't really like the second one from Giant or or Stop and Shop. You gave it five balls. Just letting you know. Well, you know, I wasn't a fan of it the second time. Okay. Maybe, uh, you know, people's taste buds change. Within a week? Well, when was the last time we had that peanut butter? This just just like two weeks, three weeks ago. That's it. Well, you know, maybe my taste buds have matured. Okay. I'm 30 now, so maybe <laughs> it's the aging taste buds. All right, shall we move on? Sure. Do you want the free supermarket sample or the cereal that's not really a cereal? What do cereal, you want Cereal, not cereal. Okay. Great. So this is another one I found in the healthy section. I also have to apologize really quick. I'm sorry that not last week, but the two weeks prior that there weren't videos. I realized you can't do screen recordings on Zoom and send them to the cloud. The cloud doesn't work. Nobody understands what you're talking about. They do. Because no. there was no YouTube episode for a while. For a while? Two weeks. Dude, you totally just ruined my income. 
Well, I mean, aren't you the one who says that you don't make anything from this podcast? Well, I don't, but now do you it's know what the negative. Is? Now it's negative. So how do you know? All right, can I go down and get the <laughs> there cereal go. that's not a cereal? Have a nice day, Scott. I'm going to, Andrew. Good. So I got this from the healthy section, Woo! the little organic. That was a lot. What? What? That was a <laughs> crack sighting. Is that a crack <laughs> sandwich that you just got? Ooh, Lord, right. baby Jesus. This cereal is soft. <laughs> San Andreas fault. It, it, almost, it almost feels like a broken up cookie or piece of cake or something like that. It's from the Toasted Oat Bakehouse Soft Granola I wanna, Cherry Streusel. I want to feel it. Gluten-free. I wanna, Here you go. I don't like the feeling of this. Okay. Ugh. It I, feels like there's like sardines in there. Sardines? Yeah. It says it's perfect for breakfast, snacking, or recipes, and more. Made with organic coconut oil. Okay. So, and it's made in small batches. I'm excited for it because I love all things cherry. My favorite summer fruit, cherries. Love them. My dad loves cherries. I've tried getting into cherries by themselves. I can't. I do, however, enjoy... Um, What's the one that's basically just sugar and they put on top of ice cream? Boba? Maraschino cherries. Oh, maraschino cherries. Oh, my God. I love those. Yeah, I could eat those by the jar. Yeah. I used to hate them as a kid, and I don't know. Maybe it's my mature taste buds. You know what? I watched it on, like, How It's Made or one of those shows or it's something. It's just sugar. And then I didn't like it anymore. <laughs> yeah, they're just pure sugar. But they are yummy. Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, um, by the way, don't ever buy cherries if they're more than, like, two ninety nine a pound because you're paying too much. Oh. Just letting you know. That's a tip from Coupon Corner. And that's Scott's tip of the <laughs> yeah. day. But they have a very short. They have a very short season. Oh, like they're you're only going to get them until like August, mid August, and then they're done, or even early August. So I now's also, the time. Every time I have a cherry, I always get like a <laughs> noise afterwards. Yeah, know, you know, you're allergic to everything. Yeah. So there are very, very, very few cherries in here. I'll tell you that because the cup I just poured for you does not even have one. Oh, okay, great. Yeah, there's full almonds. 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 I. I just poured two cups, and I didn't get one cherry. Oh, great. So I'm going to squeeze one out. Ew. <laughs> you could just yeah. put just, your hand in. No, I'm not putting my hand in. Well, then again, because you won't ever eat this again. Yeah. Ew, it looks worse when you're squeezing oh, a cereal into a cup. All right, I just pinched one out, Andrew. Gross. I pinched one into I don't need cup. to hear it. I don't need to hear it. <laughs> but there are full almonds and some soft. I don't even know if this needs milk. This is more like cake. This looks like an oatmeal. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm still excited for it. Please never suck on the spoon like Sorry. That. Milk fell, milk was on it. All right, ready? That's One, a big cherry. Two, three. It's a full cherry. Watch for pitch, Andy. Hmm. <laughs> well. It basically tastes like it tastes like paint. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't. Oh my god, that cherry is rancid. <laughs> oh, <holy hell. coughs> what the hell happened? <sighs> the cherries are rancid. I don't know what happened. What I don't the? like <coughs> it. I don't like it. <coughs> it's, it's good until September. It, it just tastes like paint. <laughs> I don't I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> What the hell was that? Ugh. I think there's something wrong with the cherries. I think there's just something wrong with the cereal. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What's in it? Gluten-free gluten free oats, organic honey, organic Ugh. coconut oil, organic brown sugar, golden flaxseed, almonds, dried cherries, salgon, cinnamon, oh. salt, vanilla, macadamia nuts, cashews. Everything sounds perfect. No, What's it's wrong not, with it? It's not perfect. Zero. <laughs> No balls, no spoons. That's I don't disgusting. understand. This honestly ranks as one of the worst of all time. Dude. That look, was so bad. Look how good it looks. If you ever see this, take it off the shelf and throw <coughs> it. <laughs> you could fertilize plants with that. This is not for human consumption. <laughs> oh, my God. It legit tastes like paint. I don't know what that was. There's something wrong with the cherries. I think there's just something wrong with the period. But I don't think it was bad until I got the cherry because it I just, rebuke thee in the name of Jesus. It just tasted like <laughs> it tasted like a mouthful of brown sugar and then rancid. Yeah, no, it's got a that that's this. You know what I think of this one? Let me make sure this is. Just don't throw it out. We have to take a picture. <laughs> Yoink! <laughs> okay, 
You didn't rate it, Andrew. Yeah, nothing. Okay. That was honestly one of the worst cereals wow. I've ever had. I in my already life. have a stomach ache. That was so bad. Like it just was globby in your mouth, and it had like this thick paint taste. I don't know what was going on there. Just I've never had a cereal like that before. I'm, I would like to give them another shot with a different flavor. I swear we are not doing that right now. No, no, not now. Okay, thank you, Jesus. No, I don't have it. I need some recovery time because I almost bombed. Okay. It was so, like right here, <laughs> right in my throat. Let's just just move past it. Ugh. So when uh, a few weeks ago, or months, it's actually <sighs> months already at this point, when I got that calendar that you like. Oh, what are those? Papusas? Mm, yeah. You like papusas. Uh, oh, let's see what let's see what the next month is going to be. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. I love cheeseburgers. So when I picked up that calendar at the Food Bazaar supermarket, at the end of the cash register thing, they had free samples. Ooh. So look what I got you. Familia. Familia, the original Swiss muesli. Ooh. Isn't that how you say it? Didn't we decide that it's muesli? Yeah. There you go. So what is this? It's muesli. The... It's just like granola, whatever. Can you pour me? Yeah, I'm going to pour it. Thank you. Mm-hmm. I think something bland, plain, and overall boring is going to be just what I need right okay. now. I'm sick. Yeah, that was so bad. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it feels like an old person cereal. That stuff? Yeah. Well, why? Because they can't chew and it's just yeah. it's, it's mashed. I was <laughs> like, maybe if I put it in my gums a little bit. Oh, Jesus Christ. It sorry. wasn't good. No, this is this is like raw oatmeal. I'm good with that. <laughs> Anything is better than what I just had. This this is more like a yogurt topping than it is a cereal. It actually has recommended to serve with yogurt on the oh, back. Well. There you go. Did you dump your spoon? Yes. Okay. I was in a fit of the bombs, so <laughs> I wasn't even thinking. There you go. Raisins and little pieces of stuff. I don't know. Let's see. Here we go. One, two, three. You know what? This is two bowls. Ugh. It's just like sawdust on the floor after someone vomited, and they're drying up the vomit with sawdust. Well, and that's the vomit lo- just came from that soft granola cereal. That's what it looks like, too. Yeah. I mean, mm. it's bird food. Yeah. Yeah, look. Can I do a sip? This gets a bowl and a spoon it's for just me. oats. I'm going to give it a bowl. Because uh, it tastes like sawdust. It was a palate cleanser. I I'll guess. I'll that. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. What hey, a great episode. <laughs> you haven't been recording the whole time. What do you mean? I'm kidding. Um, That's you. Mine always records. I know. Well, I mean, thank you for <coughs> listening to this exciting episode of Serial Killers. What oh, a waste. Yeah. It right? was so delicious. That was wonderful. I had a great time. Thank you again, Scott. Hey, I tried. Yeah. Didn't try hard enough. <laughs> Got anything else, Andy? We're kind of short. Uh, I mean, I think I just had like... I have a little bit of PTSD from it, so I- I'd be fine shutting this episode off. Oh, okay. On the next Serial Killers. Just a little preview of what's coming up on the next Serial Killers, Andrew. I mean, that's what he would imply by saying on the next Serial Killers. One of the cereals that you received, because you sent a nice <coughs> email yeah. to our friends at General Mills. Yeah, I did my job. So that comes next week. Thank you very much. Where it'll be? Oh, it'll be mid-July. Hot as balls. Yeah. Right? I definitely can't be walking to the studio in this weather. You can tell when it's hot in here because the refrigerators are sweaty. Oh, I hate when that happens. Right? Sweaty fridge. I hate this time of the city because it's just like you walk outside. And it smells like hot garbage Ugh. and urine. Yeah, it's yeah. not the best. Good times. Yeah. Love mm-hmm. New York. Well, thanks for listening. <laughs> if Please, I uh, can make it there, I can make it all right. anywhere. Please follow us on social media. You, at Serial Killers. New PC. York. New York. All right. And check out SerialKillersPC.com for all the latest serial news. Yeah. None of that. Um, oh, I'm sorry. The recent episodes are posted, and you could also check out the serial rankings. And we're also figuring out a way to maybe get you guys some shirts. I heard that Scott was like doing something cool soon. Scott is. Scott Other and Scott. I have been talking. Other, Other Scott. Scott is great, and he does a great job on the website, so let's not be a tool, Scott. I'm not. I love you, Scott. Other Scott. All right. Thanks for listening. We will see you next New week. New Bowl Chat this Wednesday. I don't know about that. I do, because we'll I schedule them. But it's just going to be an empty shell, because there's not going to be anything recorded. Why is that? I don't know. Have a great week. We'll see you next Monday, maybe Wednesday. I don't know. Are you cryptically sabotaging the podcast? For another fantastic like episode of Serial Killers, the podcast where we talk about cereal and we think inside the box. You're really throwing everything at the, the yeah. window. I'm hoping it sticks. Yep. 
Until we see you then, say crunch, Andrew. Crunch! Crunch! You going home now? No. Bull chat time. No. Yeah. Unless you could drive me home. Not driving you home. Damn it. Okay, so then you're forced to do a bull chat. Bye. Bye. Okay, I'll drive you home. Bye.